All right, Shalom. First talk of all, praise, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Kadash, the bonus to the apostles and the elders of GMS. Salutes and honors to the elect, all the brothers across the four corners who are enduring in truth and in sincerity, and the women and the children who follow. So, as you can see, I know there's been a lot of controversy out here about um, whether it's 5G that's, uh, you know, killing people, messing up people. And whether it's actual natural virus that an actual coronavirus out here killing people. And I just want to, you know, give my two cents on, on what it is. And I'm going to preface it with the scripture, uh, which is Corinthians 13 and 9. It says, for we know in part and we prophesy in part because we, we do know that people are dying. We do know fuck it, that people are being judged in the ultimate way. Now, is it 5G? Or is it an actual virus? Okay, so and I know a lot of brothers feel heavy that it's 5G that's killing people. But, you know, I believe that, it's, it, that it is the actual virus. And, you know, they, they'll bring proofs like um, the coronavirus came out, you know, November of last year, November, December of last year. And they started in Wuhan, China putting up the 5G, that's where it was first done. And that's where the outbreak supposedly take uh, or started or whatnot. And then they'll say, well, you know, that's why people are getting sick and that's why people are dying. But in my research of how 5G works and how microwave waves work, I don't think it would kill anybody like that. You would have to be under a tremendous amount of microwaves to, you know, be killed like that. And I don't, also, I don't think that you would go out like that as well. So I'm just going to explain it a little bit. Um, So bring up the picture real quick. So when you're dealing with 5G, matter of fact, before I even, you know, go into that, I want to get these scriptures. Okay, this is Revelations 12 and 12. It says, therefore rejo rejoice ye heavens and ye that dwell in them. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea, for the devil is coming down unto you, having a great wrath, because he knows he has but a short time. And that's the time we're living in. We're living in him, you know, bringing that wrath down because he knows he has a short time. He knows that he has, you know, a small window to, to get this new world war started. So that's why, he, that's why, you know, all this is happening now. Okay, so that's why we're, we're seeing these, this mass death. This mass sickness, this uh, hysteria in the people. We're seeing all that now uh, because the devil, this devil's making his move, okay? Um, and that's why, like I also said, you know, Revelation uh, 11 and 8, it says, And their dead bodies so shall lie in the streets of the great city, which spiritually is called Sodom in Egypt, where also our Lord was crucified. And dead, their dead bodies are piling up here in America, man. It's been maybe... A day or two since I've checked it, so I know I know we're, we're last time I checked it we were in the five thousands, and they've been going up almost a thousand dollars or thousand people a day, so it's it's easily to believe it to be in the seven thousands. You know you can't don't hold it to me, but you know we should be in about seven thousand dead, and probably somewhere in the high two hundred thousands infected, if not more. Um. But like I said, I believe that it is an actual virus, and I'll give my reasons for that here in a moment. But I just want to explain, like I said, my research, uh, and then I'll come back. Well, before I, Sakia, let me, I'll get this last scripture, and then we'll go into the 5G. Okay, this is Jeremiah 9, and starting at 21, it says, For death has come up into our windows, and has entered into our places to cut off the children from without, and the young men in, from the streets. The, it's cutting off the young men from the streets because everybody's in the house, okay? That quarantine's out, you know, uh, martial law is about to be declared pretty soon. It's going to be all hell in this place. But it says, speak thus saith the Lord, even the carcasses of men shall fall as dung upon the open field. And as the handful of, and as the handful after the harvest men and none shall gather them. All right, because pretty soon people are just going to be dropping dead and it's going to be normal to see, you know, 
piles of dead people, dead bodies lying everywhere. That's that's the time that we're coming to. That's the Jacob's trouble. That's the time that never was before that people don't understand how serious and um, respect this situation for really what it is. So with that being said, let's get into the 5G. This is a picture of a 5G tower. Okay, so, uh, and I wish I could, let me see. Let me see if I can manufacture this real quick. Y'all work with me. I need some light. We gonna pull up the camera. Sorry, how long? Am I? right next to you know one of these towers his 5g works excellent but right when he went around the corner and it was blocked by a building 5g didn't work okay so because 5g the way that they talk they're not able to start penetrating buildings preface the video we prophesy in part we know in part okay so that's why uh, i wanted to give that information so those 5g waves aren't that strong but you are no but they're microwave waves right so that's what people are saying and you know you catch radiation from your microwave you also catch radiation from your phone from the sun from these power plants that that are around us everything's giving off radiation Okay, if you, if you say, hey, Siri, on your phone, and your phone responds, that, that response is going to give off radiation because of the Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi is kicking our ass, too. Radiation is everywhere, okay? And when, when you get radiation poisoning, it's more of like um, like you're sick to your stomach, you throw up, stuff like that. It's not respiratory. That's why I say that there is a virus out here. Because people are dying, not because of, you know, them throwing up and being sick to their stomachs and stuff like that. You know, people go through chemo all the time and live through it. You know, treatment after treatment after treatment. You know, all of a sudden they're putting up these 5G towers. You're telling me this 5G is stronger than chemo? But you're not losing hair? But, okay, but that's that's another type of uh, radiation. Um, but... How how is it that people are dying respiratory? Okay, because that's what SARS is. SARS is a a respiratory uh, virus, which is the disease that's caused by the COVID nineteen coronavirus. Or you catch the virus first, and then you know you once you get the virus, it mutates into a disease, just like uh, HIV and AIDS. You know, uh, similar to that. So. Once you catch the, once you get the coronavirus, it uh, it gets into your, into your lung system. Once it's in your lungs, and it 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 basically, it closes your throat until you can't breathe. That's why they need all the respirators because these people can't breathe when they're dying, and you know you can't touch them because then you'll get it. You can't breathe their air because then you'll get it. If you can't breathe their air, then how? Why wouldn't you be able to breathe five or, you know, somebody who has radiation poisoning? Why wouldn't you be able to breathe their air? Would you get radiation poison from breathing their air? What about the people that were on boats that, you know, were in separate cabins from other people? How did they, how did it spread through, you know, through the, throughout the boat? Did they put a 5G post on the boat? You know, and I'm not trying to knock anybody who believes that it's 5G. Because like I said, 5G is definitely playing a part. 
and I'm, you know, I'm definitely, and I'm going to get into that as well, but, you know, everything's pointing towards the, the virus being the actual virus, and uh, in my opinion, but, like I said, um, these 5G towers, they do play a, a major part, because the military, what are they, what are they doing, they're using this virus to bring in the military, once the military's here, they can set up everything else, okay, which is, all right, so this is the, the I believe, you know, this is what do, was doing it. It's the actual virus, not the 5G. I believe it's the virus. But um, this is what they need 5G for. And, th and yeah, radiation is going to, it is affecting our daily lives. It is fucking us up. But I don't believe it's fucking us up to the point that it kills us fast. It's more of a slow burn. But this right here, you know, that that's a military robot holding a gun. How is this robot being controlled? It's being controlled by an actual by an actual soldier with like um how can I explain this? Like a virtual reality kind of setup to where he can see um like like it'll have like sensors where like where the eyes are where the the soldier can see you know and he pull up his gun and the robot will pull up his gun or he can walk to the left three paces and the robot will walk to the left three paces. You know, you need 5G for that. And if, now if you have 5G set up all over the city, then you're always within range because like I said, those waves don't travel far. So if you go out of range, that robot's not going to be able to respond the way that that person needs it to. That's why they need 5G, because they have shit like this waiting for us. And like I, like I said before, it's a time they never was. So who knows what else they have? Also, this. Okay, that RFID chip. Okay, the um, the mark of the beast. If everybody's got to have one of these, you know, they got to have a network to not only empower all the chips, but to basically handle handle all the information and all that and, you know, uh, activate the chips and just for them to work in general is what I'm saying. And 5G is, is, is able, the next generation is able to handle that. So in my humble opinion, is 5G fucking us up? Yes. Is 5G for our downfall? Yes. But this is how they're this is how they're using 5G. They're using coronavirus, the actual virus, to set up the, the circumstances, the conditions to make the 5G effective the way that they need to use it. So with that being said, that's my humble opinion. Like I said, we know in part, we prophesy in part. You know, we, we'll see. You know, that's all we can say. But with that being said, I give all praise, honor, and glory unto Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Rukar Kadash, the bonus to the apostles and the elders of GMS, salutes and honors to the elect, all the brothers across the four corners to our enduring and truth and in sincerity and the women of the children who follow. Shalom.